Hello, I'm Montague McBrain, Bible professor. I study the things that Jesus taught and the way Jesus lived. Ah, you're back. Now, you may have heard it said that Jesus told his followers not to worry about all the stuff you have and not to store up treasures on earth. Well, God's people have always strived to live out this teaching. But it's really, really hard. For example... Dude, I love surfing. It's awesome. And I love Jesus. He's awesome. But the other day, I was out on the waves and it was the biggest wipeout you've ever seen. And my board just went, psh, it just snapped everywhere. So I wanted to get another board, but then my church, they needed some more money to hire another children's worker. So, so I gave all the money to them. And, uh, and that was good, but now I don't have any money for a new board. Oh, I tell you what, it's really hard to live God's way like that. Does God understand what that feels like? Yeah, so I really wanted a, a new 3DS. And so I, I saved up heaps of money to buy one. Like I, I washed mum's car five times to get one. So then I finally had enough money to get a, a 3DS, but my friend, he, um, he lost his guinea pig and he was really, really sad. So uh, I love Jesus. And so I wanted to show my friend love by uh, getting him a new guinea pig. So uh, that he was really happy about that, but then I didn't have any uh, money for a DS anymore, and that's really hard. Uh, does God understand what that feels like? I read about this family. Uh, they used to live in Australia where they could have had all kinds of nice things. They could have had a really nice house or a really nice car. But instead, they've gone to another country to tell other people about Jesus. But sometimes it's really hard and they don't have anywhere near what they used to have. Does God understand? Does God know what that's like? Does God know just how hard it is to live this way? This is a question of enormous proportions. And to answer it, we need to remember that Jesus is God. Jesus had it all. He lived in heaven with God. He had the perfect life with everything he could ever need. And he gave it all up. All of it. He came to earth as a tiny little baby. And for most of his life, he, he had no house. And of course, he gave it all up when he died on the cross. So, God does know just how hard it can be to go without things. He went without everything. So he does know how awful it can be. Which means, when you don't worry about having lots of stuff, you are being like God. I'm Montague McBrain, Bible Professor.